Hi, I'm Kathy Demchuk. I'd like to welcome you to our home and garden. I am a fabric collage artist. I studied art all through school and university. I got my teaching degree as a science teacher and my master's degree as an art teacher and loved it. And when I retired, I really wanted to develop my own art. I actually was very fond of working with clay at school and I thought I was going to pursue clay. And then I started doing some traditional quilting, which I enjoyed, but I wanted to do more with it. And at school, I'd been painting on fabric with the kids and became familiar with that sun-sensitive fabric paint and thought it had a lot of potential. So those things all kind of blended together when I retired. Most of the work that I've been passionate about has been a whimsical message about taking care of the environment. So I've done quite a few quilts where I have taken animals, mostly birds, from the environment and, and given them human characteristics. So I've put seagulls with vests on cleaning up the beaches. So this is the third in a series that I'm starting on birds' nests. There was a, a little nest built in that hanging basket and we could see the little birds building the nest and then they then they disappeared. I don't know what happened to the little birds but I was up trimming the flowers and I saw that the little nest was still in the basket with the little eggs in it and that just got me thinking about nests and we went for a walk on a beach out at Ten Mile Point and the rocks look egg-shaped so I collected up some rocks and said to Pete I'm going to try making a little nest. And I mostly work with spray bottles. I sometimes use sponges and brushes as well, but I use spray bottles quite a bit. So I build up the paint, which I've used. I mix some of the colors so I can get different shades. And once I've built up a good amount of paint on here, quite wet, and I can move it around with my fingers a bit. Just keep layering on until I feel like I've got enough. I first learned this technique when I was teaching. Um, it's like a camera reaction. So when you put the paint on the fabric where there's a shadow on the fabric, the heat and the light draw the color away from underneath. So you get the, the negative image of the object that's lying on top. I have a nest that I finished last week. This is the next step. So this one, after it's stitched on there, then I put a batting and a backing on here, and then I start quilting. So here, this one, I got different kinds of lines happening here. And what really attracts me to this one is the lines, the graphic look. So I tried to follow those lines out with my quilting stitches. And now what I'm doing is embellishing it. Thank you for watching this little video clip about my artwork. I would love to invite you to visit our website and say hi, leave a message. We always post any shows that we're involved in on that website. We're hoping to have a garden studio tour in September of 2020. That information will be posted on the website.